Let me interrupt you and ask you, when you say you're being told and through all these conversations and everything, who's your point person that's communicating this to you, or is it a combination of people, or who is it that you're getting your marching orders from? The project team was managed by the project governance team, and that included um, uh, executives from DHS. The, uh, uh, the two key executives that we often spoke with and got direction from would be Mr. Wyatt and Johnny Jones. Okay, and did you, when that date you just mentioned, were you issued, that was an extension of a contract already in place, or was there a new contract that was for, for being called back in on the project? Neither, sir. It was just a reassignment of roles. So okay. that was a new focus. Okay. However, as part of that assignment, we were asked to bring in additional resources to address many of the, the unfinished business uh, of building the system. So it, our role did go back to being a system integrator in May. And we were asked to also take on some <coughs> of the responsibilities of system development. And if you look at my the graph here, system integration function is different than software customization. The people who are cleaning the engine are different than who are building the rest of the vehicle. We, our job was to connect the system to all the external systems, healthcare.gov, the IRS, the social security, the Medicaid management system, the HX, and so on. So as a system integrator, we rely upon the vendors to do the core system integration. In May, we were told to take on some of those responsibilities as well. So from May to October, we went back into hyper build phase. It was very much measurable. We were back to doing what we were doing in 2013 with another deadline looming and another rush to get everything done. We're very proud of what got done in that period. Uh, release 1.2, 1.3, 1.4, 1.4.2 were all released in that time frame that we are speaking of from May to October. Okay, for those of us who don't know what that means, that 1.1 and 1.2, give, give us a brief explanation of what that means. Or is it in the note somewhere? Yes, sir. It's right here. I'll cover that for you. So one dot two. Okay, if you're going to cover, just you can wait. Okay. Uh, I can go there right away. Okay. So release one dot two was planned for five sixteen, delivered on five thirty. It was for federal poverty limit changes, notice generation, and assist a and an upgrade to the Ethereum engine to fix certain issues in the in the, in the software. Release one dot three was done on six point seven. Magi retroactive coverage for pregnant women and children and other other beneficiaries who are allowed to apply late and get retroactive coverage for certain publishing segments. Release 1.4.2 was delivered on 7.13, and then the remaining part was delivered on 12.31. And then Release 1.5, which I'll cover in greater detail, was delivered on 12.12.2000. <coughs> Those were the things we were accountable for and responsible for. 